It's a modular computer. Mm -hmm. A new architecture called XI3. Okay. Uh, it has a three-board modular uh, design, so you can upgrade um, logic as, as new technologies come out. Okay. Kind of designed to, to obsolete, obsolescence. Right. So get rid of the, you know, having to throw your computer away every three years. I can see you have more USB ports than some people already. Yeah, yeah exactly. As it is. <laughs> this thing is cram packed, so it's got an integrated graphics card, uh -huh. dual high definition displays. Okay. We can expand that up to five displays off of one box. This is the box running, running over here. Okay, I see, I see that. So now, now processor wise, what processor is this? This one's running a dual core AMD processor. Okay. Um, but it's designed as a whole new architecture, so you can build any type of processor around it. So, we, Intel, AMD. If I try to throw an i Core 7 there, would, that, would I be able to? We can that? design an i Core 7. Uh, okay. Version right. of it. Yeah. Now I'm interested. Very interesting. <laughs> what is it so, in terms of storage inside of this? So we do storage a little different. We, we do solid state storage inside. Uh -huh. so normally a small amount, like 32 gig. Yeah. Enough to run an operating system. And then we have the expandability slot here. It's a new port called X Media, which allows you this, this mounting system. So it's got a three sided mounting bracket. Yeah. So you can mount a uh, terabyte drive, spinning drives if you want. You can mount solid state drives to it just by hanging it up, attaching it to it. So basically everything is built around that three core system. Yeah, it's kind of like a little engine that's, that's like a Le Legos for computer. You build it up as you need it. Okay, nice. Now, as far as the, the internal storage, that, that's just for putting operating system on. And Essentially. Is it built right on the, like, physically on the board? Is it it's solid state? Uh, it's, it's, it's soldered down. Yeah. Soldered down, okay. And then... Uh, We've been finding most of the big companies nowadays want want very little on the box because they're doing you know they're streaming things to it. Yeah. Cloud. They don't want anything stored locally, yeah. so we separate that. But for consumers, you know they're going to want to hook a terabyte drive to this, yeah. use it as a DVR, and store all their movies on it. So now, now what I know this because basically you said you can be, deal uh, build different system setups for this. What's your base uh, price range for the system? Uh, retail is eight forty nine on this box. Yeah. And then uh, we're coming out with different power bands, so we'll release an i7 box, you know, that, that it might be a little more expensive, we'll release a, you know, a lower end box that can be used for uh, small embedded applications, like to run an ATM or something like that. It's designed as a universal <laughs> engine. <laughs> so, uh, as far as USB reports, does it have a 3.0 and 2.0? Right now it's 2.0. Uh, we'll design an, uh, a 3.0 backplane, so for like 100 bucks you'll be able to swap out that backplane uh -huh. and, and upgrade your computer without throwing it away. Not, what's that? Sorry, I, just, I saw something. This is one of the early prototypes, so it okay. still has some of the testing ports on it. Okay. Uh, but that's the finished product there that we took up to. Will there be options for, like, um, I see this Debian, but not some HDMI if they want to use Yeah, we can change this uh, display port to an HDMI port. Okay. You can also dongle off uh, to a converter that converts it to HDMI. Do um, have wireless built in? Uh, we do wireless through the X Media, so we'll have a little snap on card that'll do 802.11 Bluetooth. Is the Ethernet port Gigabit? Gigabit Ethernet. Nice. You guys have nice connection, a, little, a nice little mini pack. I mean, like you said, for businesses, this works out very well because businesses love it. They can you can put it in like a universal mounting bracket that mount it, you know, up behind your your monitor. monitor yeah. That's pretty much it's out it. Out of the way. Yeah, it seems look it creates very little. And it saves them up to 95 percent on their power bill. This is this is very very nice. Very nice. Thank you. I mean, it's it's the guy that invented it. Oh, it is. Yeah. The CEO, the inventor. As he's busy over there. <laughs> Making business. <laughs> like it? It's good. I mean, it's the fact that it's 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 a system that can can grow. It's still a small compact is pretty good.